to my Merrimack Valley home. I'm out here today walking around in my garden because it's been raining a lot for the last couple days and this is the first day that it hasn't rained. So uh, I'm getting out here kind of checking around on things. Um, we have uh, a lot of things that we can um, look at here. I just want to show you a few things though. Um, just a second and I'm going to turn it around here. Over here we've got my Jerusalem artichokes. Those are what they call sunchokes, but they grow up just like a sunflower. In fact, they're in the sunflower family. And uh, those look like they're doing well. I had to spray them for aphids though. They were getting aphids on them. And if you don't know what an aphid looks like, I can show you. These are pretty much dead, I think. Kind of get right up underneath there. Kind of see what they look like. Maybe a little better there. But they're just little bitty um, critters, <laughs> I call them. And uh, they are not good for your plants. So I bought some organic uh, spray. Uh, there are some sites uh, on Google that you can make your own sprays, but I just bought some uh, from Lowe's and it was organic. Uh, and as soon as we sprayed them, they, they died. I do have to kind of keep a watch and follow up on them though because uh, I do see a few more out here, so I'm going to probably be spraying them again, but I do want to wait and make sure it's not going to rain again. The sky is a little bit cloudy, as you can see, so um, we'll wait and see. Now, I come out here to trim some herbs and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to run back in the house because I think I forgot my scissors and we're gonna go trim up some of my uh, <laughs> some of my sweet mint I have on the other side of the house it's growing like wildflower uh, fire and I've got to get it some of that thinned out so um, I will be uh, going in the house and getting my <laughs> scissors and uh, I will be back in just
as you can see, I got quite a bit of sweet mint. Um, big old bowl full. And I'm going to be going in and washing this up here in a few minutes. I was going to cut from my other plants down here um, my thyme, uh, my oregano, my lemon balm, my chamomile, and my basils and my sages. But I decided I'm going to wait for another day to do that because once I wash up the sweet mint, then I'm going to put it in this nifty bag that sits right here. I'll get a little bit better Go up on my stairs here. And it's a drying bag. And you can dry all sorts of things in there. Vegetables, I've got some some um, garlic in there right now. Uh, at the top here, I've got some uh, dill. And at the very top here, I've got some uh, sage. So, got that. And we've got that. That's the dill. This is my garlic that's drying. I didn't have as good a crop this year on garlic like I would like to, but it is, uh, I don't know. It, it, I had a better crop last year than this year. I just don't know why. Planted it in the same spot, planted it at the same time. It's just one of those things. But basically, I am going to go ahead and go in the house. I'm going to go wash this uh, mint up. And then once it's washed and it's uh, drained a little bit and kind of dried a little bit, I'm going to bring it out here and put it in my drying bag um, slash rack, drying bag rack. So, I'll be back with you in just, just a few minutes. So now I'm out on my back porch where my drying rack is. I've done washed thoroughly and cleaned my uh, sweet mint. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and put it in my drying rack and get a little bit better look at it from here. 
but I think I'm going to have to put it down lower this time. Maybe to here. I don't know. Let's see. There we go. Let me get it open here. And take all my mint. Kind of stretch it out in there. Well, at least it's cooled off a little bit. It's uh, not rain yet, though. Now I'm trying to get this kind of spaced out a little bit. I may have to go to the bottom one, too, just to get the space needed to kind of keep them apart so they will dry. Well, I can smell that mint. It is so fresh. All right, let's see here if I can do this. Just gonna add what's left. Just on a whole lot, it just I guess gives it more room to do some drying. So we'll put that one back there. <laughs> 